And here with a crowd-pleasing recipe in our CI kitchen, Christina Adams for Sarah Bush Lincoln Health Systems been slaving away. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> on our soup here. Making some delicious soup that is part of her, one of the things that is on the menu for your HMR program, That's right? That's right. It's one of the, the tools that we help with patients once they've got through their weight loss phase and are really thinking long-term weight management. So we want to make sure they have the right tools going back to the real world, if you will, to, yeah. to be able to manage that weight long term, whether it's cooking at home, eating out, grocery shopping, all of the above. If you're not smart about what you're eating, you are more likely to go back to your weight-related health problems, Those right? old habits are hard to leave behind, and they're ready to come back with a vengeance. <laughs> and you have to be very... And the quality of food is not always what you expect. So you, right. I mean, you've been on the show before always saying, make sure you're reading your labels, make sure you're being smart about what you're using. Yeah, and that's what I liked about this recipe and a lot of the ones we do with our cooking demo is I try to, to use simple ingredients that don't have a lot of things you can't pronounce on the label for yeah. that reason. So that lemon bar over there, that <laughs> would totally fit with the HMR uh, plan, right? Moderation. Is that that's, that? Right, that's right. Moderation. Doesn't mean denial entirely, but just be, be smart to be moderate. And this soup had just a handful of ingredients. Yeah, and you can change it up. That's one thing that is great about soups is they're so versatile. If you don't like the white northern beans, you could do black eyed peas. You could do a black bean even and, you know, be an interesting color coordinate with everything going on. You could do a different vegetable if you wanted to instead of corn. So, I mean, it's very versatile. You could even do a different uh, meat if you wanted. What are the other soups that are part of this program? And, and we're talking soups a lot because it's winter and people yeah. are more inclined to do things that are warm and give them the warmth on the inside. Great question because with the weight loss program, we have specific meal replacements that they purchase to do the program. So, there's actually a chicken soup involved with that. Is that what that. the MR is, is meal replacement? It's, yes, health management resources okay. is actually okay. what it stands for. <laughs> <laughs> a lot of people think <laughs> Right yes. idea, but yeah, not the right name. <laughs> so, yeah, so the, what we're doing with the cooking demos is kind of going beyond the weight loss foods and, and showing them how healthy they can do to make their own weight loss foods, essentially. I so with the that. soups, we're just doing a lot of different varieties with different ways to, to make soups, whether it be, you know, tomato-based or broth-based. Real okay. quick, go over, if you would, what you put in this again. Yes, yeah. just joining perfectly. Us. We did uh, boil the chicken and made our own broth, so that was the first step with mm -hmm. lemon, pepper, and cumin. So no sodium at all on this recipe, other than what you might get from the beans, but those were rinsed. I bought no sodium sodium corn. Everything was canned. Mm. We just rinsed it off and then the green chilies in the can and then just cumin and lemon pepper um, for seasoning and that was pretty much yeah. it. Yeah, and on um, busy nights, just toss it in the crock pot and go. Yeah, Heather and I are salt addicts we and, are. You, and, you, and you don't miss it. No, Honestly, it's, it's, it's really that good. <laughs> yeah, I think yeah. Just with no salt in there, like I said, the fat, it just brings more of the fresh flavors out of the ingredients in the recipe. All right. Mm. Well, and this recipe is actually going to be on CILiving.tv. Oh, thank you so much. Thank you. I appreciate mm. it.